So I was um, going to Summerfest with one of my bridesmaids, Rachel, and he was at Summerfest with two more of my friends, and then we just happened to meet. So the first time we met, it was Summerfest 2012. I was walking around uh, with some friends of mine. They met up with these girls that they knew. Um, they sort of swarmed around one particular friend. So I was like, me and the other girl was just left alone. I, me and her talked, vibed really, really well together. But we had fun and started texting, and that was, that was the first day. Around the time when we first became boyfriend and girlfriend, there was some like challenging things that were happening in my life, and he was just always there. He was always there, he was always supportive, he was always like ready to help with anything he needed to, and I think that's when I finally realized, like, oh my god, he's the one. We were watching a movie together, and I get a text from my dad that uh, his dog had passed, and it like threw me off. It, really messed me up for a moment. She dropped everything and still like supported me and helped me like grieve properly and whatnot. And like, it felt right. <laughs> so I think that was probably the day I knew that I needed to definitely put my, put my foot in gear on the gas uh, and plow ahead. Good. You look beautiful. Beautiful. So wow. Wow. <laughs> Makeup is great. Everything looks great. So, we're ready to get this done. <laughs> <laughs> we're ready. We're ready. compared to a journey. But a journey implies that there is an end point, a destination. But marriage doesn't have a destination. There is no end credit scene. It is a never ending story that builds through the years and reaches across generations. Kayla and Cole, you are the continuation of the story of your parents and their parents and your great grandparents. You are the midpoint of your family's story, and that continues through to your children and their children. But there will be conflict. All great stories have them. There will be times when you are seemingly not on the same page. Kayla, he will laugh at something, and you will know there is nothing funny. <laughs> <laughs> and Cole, Cole, you may get frustrated because you're standing in a hurricane of chaos, and she's completely calm. There will be times where it seems like the other person just doesn't understand. But your heart is your guiding key. My advice to you is no matter where you are in the story, remember you always have a choice. The way you choose to love and show love will ripple through generations and become a part of their story. So when in doubt, choose patience, choose honesty, choose laughter, choose empathy, choose love, choose each other. I have never had a harder time writing anything in my life uh, because our journey and the love I have for you, um, there's not any words I can actually think of that properly convey um, how much I care and feel for you. You've 
loved me so hard <laughs> and so for so long that I've been able to put that away. I promise to love you as you've loved me for these years, to trust and care for you as you cared and trusted for me, to defend you as you have defended me. There's no one else I want to stand up here with. I love you. Love is a word that is used far too often, but it describes the passion that I have in my heart for you. Because of you, I laugh, smile, and dare to dream. I promise I will love, encourage, and support you through every part of our life together. I choose you, I'll choose you over and over and over again, without pause, without doubt. I'll keep choosing you. I love you, Cole, always and forever. That's a good part. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Can we make it official? Kayla's talented and stunningly perfect in every way little sister. <laughs> I can say, I could tell right when I met you, Cole, that you were a very nice and caring guy. And I could tell just how much you truly cared and loved Kayla. Cole, we are so happy that you are joining our family. I was told to say that. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, no, truly we are, we are. And we can't wait to see your love grow even stronger and stronger from here on out. So cheers to Kayla and Cole's happily ever after. Through it all, surprisingly, they have always bounced back. This is shocking for two reasons. One, one probably if they left the house would end up forgetting their head at home if given the chance. And the other would be too stubborn to leave. <laughs> I've seen these two grow over time into the spectacular people they are today. And with Cole's passion and intelligence and, cl and quick wits and Kayla's determination, strong will, and guiding presence, there is no challenge I can foresee that could get in their way. Like, no, 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 no.